We are very delighted today to have with us Right Honorable Dr. Samson Kiseka, the Prime Minister of Uganda. So you're most welcome to our studio, sir. Thank you. And uh, to talk to the Prime Minister, I have with me Mr. Charles Kabuye and Mr. Jesse Mashate from the Current Affairs section of Uganda Television. Um, the explanation of the uh, resistance committees as against the old structures, because again, people are confused about no, the there are no old structures. The old structures is uh, Motongoli, Modoka, Gombrola, and Sasa. Those are there. Mm. These so called uh, councils, uh, or call them committee, mm -hmm. you elect people <coughs> in that village. And once you elect this man, they, they have a council of the village council, and Mutongoli is involved as ex official. Then, you, when you have uh, elected the Moluka council, the Moluka chief is also involved in that as ex official. And then you go up to the other until you come to the district. Mm -hmm. So it's not, we are not uh, spanning anything. Mm -hmm. It's a matter of allowing the common man to participate in his government by electing his own leaders, initiating mm. their own program of, mm. of, 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 of mm. uh, development in their own mm. areas. Mm. That's all. It's exactly the same thing. Mm. It is that system mm. of indirect rule yeah. which we are trying to, to get rid of so that the people also participate. Whether you're educated or not educated, doesn't matter, but you participate in that. At the same time, we deploy some of the industries to go in the country, mm. so that on the countryside, people can stay on their farms at the same time working in the factories, so that there will be money. Instead of keeping all the educated people here, they will go back in their own areas. You attract them, give them attraction by introducing economy into the country. So there's no point man coming from Kasanga and come to Kampala. What for? There's money enough there. There's enough food. You know the people over there. They're your people. Why should you come and be an alien in Kampala? Mm -hmm. <laughs> you see, these are some of the ideas mm -hmm. where, they are, where I usually call it a new code or new theory of leadership, mm -hmm. whereby instead of centralizing the whole thing, we decentralize it. Instead of representative, so-called representative democracy, we have D. What else would I say? The what is the word? The participatory democracy, mm. Mm. where the ordinary man <coughs> can participate. That's why we say it must be the government of the people. Mm. That's very confident. Very Thank good. you.